You know, it recently occurred to me that I'll share my space. I'll share my food. Well, actually, maybe not. I won't share my salmon. I won't share my red snapper sautéed with garlic and onions and red peppers. And I won't share my man. My husband is mine and mine alone. Besides that, I'll share my space. I'll share my time. I'll share the road. I'll share my clothes. But it never occurred to me that I needed to share my thinking. I don't think most of us think that way. And the reason for that is because most of us including myself, did not know that there was a thinking framework that we could embrace wherein we also can apply this very important thinking skill, which is shared thinking. This thinking skill is a part of the thinking framework, which when cultivated, nurtured, and honed, it can produce and has produced for me exponential outcomes that I would have never dreamed of ordinarily. I think most of us participate in some level of shared thinking, but it's only by happenstance. We don't realize that it's a skill that's part of the thinking framework that needs to be deliberately and intentionally nurtured. Shared thinking has become a big deal for me in my business because it embraces the idea of teamwork. And teamwork insists that there's no competition, no combat, but just pure collaboration, coordination, coming together. Teamwork always works. And the reason being is because of shared thinking. So let me just run over some of the things you will look for in a person that you want to bring to the table. You want to look for someone who has a we mentality, not a me mentality. You're looking for people who understand their own value when they come to the table. Trust me, they don't understand their value and what they contribute. You're going to have a problem. Shared thinking requires you to put the we above the mean. Shared thinking allows you to compel thoughts that you wouldn't ordinarily have. What outcome are you after right now in your life? That if you applied a good dose of shared thinking, instead of hogging it all to yourself, instead of thinking you can do it all on your own, instead of thinking you don't need anybody, instead of thinking you got this, I don't need nobody. You stay over there. I want all the credits. If you understood the value of shared thinking, you would ditch that belief system today. So ask yourself this question. What area of your life can you apply shared thinking to right now? Whether it's your business, your job, your parenting, your marriage, your relationships, whatever it is, it applies across the board. When applied, it will just die. Exactly you'll be speechless. I encourage you to go ahead and click the link because I want to continue to bring you more tips regarding thinking for a change and how to embrace the thinking framework that houses the thinking skills that will get you to your altitude, the next best version of you. Go ahead, click the link and don't forget to subscribe and take the assessment test that would help you to know you to grow you. Isn't that what this is all about? Becoming the next best version of ourselves? Go ahead and click that link. Have a great day. Bye-bye.